heard you was a lame boy Get up out my face Got my head to keep calling sweater She began to wait And I need a stay Hey guys, in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys what's in my pencil case. So this year I'm going into grade 8, which is year 9 in years. And I have all the essentials you could ever need in my pencil case. So if you guys want to find out what essentials you need in your pencil case, then keep on watching. Before I show you guys what's actually in my pencil case, I want to tell you guys that this video is a collab with my YouTube friend Mia. Mia is literally the kindest person ever. And if you're not subscribed to her channel, then you're definitely missing out. If you like my content, then you'll definitely love Mia's. Mia's also doing a what's in her pencil case video that's up on her channel. So if you guys want to see what's in Mia's pencil case, make sure to go head over to her channel and watch her video right after you've watched my one. Mia's video and her channel will both be linked down below in the description box. And if you're from Mia's channel, then hey, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to both of our channels and yeah i hope you guys enjoy both of our videos let's just get on with what's in my pencil case so firstly this is my pencil case so for this school year i just have a white grid pencil case from amazon and i bought it in my school supply shopping haul so if you guys want to watch that video i'll leave it linked down in the description box but now i'm going to show you guys what's actually in my pencil case so here is my pencil case i think it's super cute and this pencil case is definitely big enough to fit all the stuff i need in it but it's not too bulky so it fits in my bag perfectly and i love how this pencil case has this little badge here it just says special you are one in a million i think this is a super cute quote to just look at whilst you're working but anyways i'm going to show you guys what's in my top pocket first so this is what my pencil case looks like it has so much stuff in it and like i said earlier it's a perfect size also the majority of the stuff in here is from amazon so just expect all this stuff to be from amazon Amazon, as that's the best online shopping place to get all your stationery from so i definitely recommend going to amazon if you haven't got your school supplies yet but anyway i'm just gonna pick out stuff one by one and tell you guys what's in my pencil case so first i have this prick stick you must have a glue in your pencil case because it's just so useful because teachers never have glues in their classroom and so much stuff happens to them so it's just brilliant to have your own glue prick sticks are just the best glues because they work so well so yeah i just have a glue in my pencil case next i have this pair of scissors they are indeed from smiggle but they still work perfectly fine so i didn't see the point in buying a new pair of scissors when these work perfectly fine but it's just useful to have a pair of scissors in your pencil case because sometimes teachers give you work to put in your book and sometimes you just need to chop the sides off otherwise it won't fit in your book so yeah it's just handy to have a pair of scissors next i have a pack of eight pastel highlighters i'm just gonna grab them all out and show you them all at once so these are the pastel highlighters this is what the end looks like it's just a normal highlighter but they are skinny highlighters because i do prefer these i definitely recommend skinny highlighters because you can also fit more in your pencil case and of course these are pastel colors to match my school supplies theme so yeah these are super cute and super handy next in my pencil case i have some pencils so i have these three pastel colored pencils these are actually normal pencils by the way but i definitely recommend have a couple of pencils in your pencil case just because you never know when you're going to need to do a diagram or something like that these pencils also have rubbers on the end which is super handy so then you don't have to go in your pencil case find a big rubber get it out and just use a big rubber it's just simple it's on the end of a pencil but these pencils will definitely come in handy sometime this school year and they're also super cute colours so I definitely recommend these pencils next in my pencil case I have a lot of felt tips again I'm just going to get them all out so you can see them all at once so these are just crayon felt tips and I definitely recommend to have some kind of felt tips in your bag as they definitely come in handy quite a lot and especially if you don't have highlighters you can also use these as highlighters but obviously I do have highlighters so I use these for other things this is what these pens look like they work super well and I definitely recommend them these are actually the same pens as I had last year because they all work perfectly fine so i didn't see the point in getting new ones so yeah i definitely recommend to have some kind of felt tips in your pencil case next in my pencil case i have my ruler so i have one of these snappable rulers these rulers are the best rulers out there these kind of snappable rulers are the normal 30 centimeter rulers they snap in half so they fit in your pencil case a lot easier you can tell this ruler is definitely going to fit in my pencil case and yeah if you're looking for a ruler then definitely get one of these snappable ones as these are the best rulers ever next i have a whiteboard pen it's just a plain back whiteboard pen and it's definitely super handy to have a whiteboard pen in your pencil case so the last thing in this main pouch is some biros i basically have four different biros these two pens are just black biros and i just write in black so it's super handy just to have a couple of black pens because often my main pens which are these two run out so then i can just use these as a backup so i definitely recommend to have some extra pens in the color you write with most then moving on to my main pens in my pencil case i have these two bic pens or bic i'm not really sure how you say it but obviously these have four different colors which is super handy and these are definitely my favorite pens by far then that's it in this big main pencil case but i'm just going to go on to these two pockets now so in this first pocket i just have a rubber and a sharpener little duo 
glitter kind of thing and it has a rubber on one end and also a sharpener on the other end this initial duo thing actually did come with a spare eraser so once you're finished with this eraser you can just put this one in there and then you don't have to buy a whole new thing i definitely recommend have a rubber and a sharpener if you have some pencils in your pencil case so in the upper pocket i just have a roll of tape having tape is a super good thing because you never know when you might need it you can literally use this tape to fix a folder or if you've ripped your skirt or something like that you could definitely fix it with some tape so having a roll of tape is definitely an essential in your pencil case so that's everything in my main pocket and in these two pockets i'm now going to move on to this front pocket so this little pocket also leads to the main pocket so you can just open this pocket and still get to that one obviously there's nothing in this pocket as i've showed you everything that's in it but i have a couple of things left here so the first thing in this pocket is another one of those four-way pens this is the exact same as these two so i'm not going to really talk about this pen but i just have it here so it's quick and easy to find but next i have these three pens these pens are actually super similar to this pen except they have different colors so these two pens both have pink purple green and blue and these are definitely my favorite pens to write with as you can color code your work and just make some cute notes with some pastel pens and these pens also go with my school supplies theme and the reason why i didn't show you this one at the same time as the other two is because this pen has different colors so it has the same pink and purple but instead of a blue and green it has yellow and orange it's super handy to have some extra colors even though this yellow is terrible because you can't see it on white paper but it's good to have a spare orange and it's good to have some more pink and purple as these colors are the ones i mainly use next in my pencil case i have a black sharpie you guys never know when you might need a black sharpie so it's super handy just to have one in your pencil case at all times definitely recommend to have a black sharpie in your pencil case then the last thing in my pencil case is this little post-it note thing so it's just basically a little mini post-it note thing and these post-it notes are actually brilliant for bookmarks or for marking any kind of book because you can just stick them in like that i just wasted one which was kind of pointless but it's fine i'll put it to use once i've finished this video so i definitely recommend these if you need to mark a certain page in a book or mark any kind of papers like that so these are super handy to have in your pencil case and yeah that is everything in my pencil case it is completely empty now as you can tell there's a lot of stuff here and this all fits in this one pencil case which is super good so i definitely recommend to get this pencil case so yeah that's everything in my pencil case for eighth grade don't forget to go and subscribe to mia and also subscribe down below like and comment and do all that good stuff thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video bye